What's going on, my PT peeps, my walking dead family, my fighters? I'm one eye bright, also known as PT. Don't know if I'm winking or blinking, but I'm definitely thinking about this possible clue to Annie with Negan's ring finger right there. Spoiler warning for all things Walking Dead. So first and foremost, I want to give a shout out to the person. I'm sadly I don't know who it is exactly who said it in the comments, but they said Negan is clearly not wearing a wedding ring in this photo. And as I highlight it and put a big old arrow right there, he's not wearing a wedding ring. And here he is right here. That's where you wear a wedding ring on your left hand on the ring finger there. So what happened to it? Did he never get it back from the Commonwealth? Did they take it from him? I don't even know. I mean, but they clearly showed it to us in season 11 part two. And then we're still asking the questions because we don't know yet come April 2023. Why is Negan in New York? Why is Maggie there too? But we know we're going to get old school Negan somewhat possibly, you know, it just makes sense that Negan reverts back to his old ways. He's on his own now, especially if he lost Annie. He's not going to just be happy old Negan like, da, 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 hey guys, I'm here. Well, he's by himself. Or is he, right? We just don't know. But Negan is a character that I think can carry a spinoff. I like Negan now. I like Maggie. And so them working together... We'll have to see if it works. Only time will tell. Seems a little odd, the pairing. But hey, it's an oddball pairing. Crazier things have happened in shows and movies before. But also, if you look at Negan's hand, you see that he has tattoos. And they weren't there before. His left hand on the knuckles. I'm guessing they're Jeffrey Dean Morgan's real tattoos. And maybe Negan got them in the years that passed since the end of The Walking Dead. Will it be explained? I don't know, like Norman Reedus has some tattoos now, and Daryl just ended up having more tattoos because Norman got them, and I doubt they wanted to cover them up with makeup and whatever, and I guess you could get a tattoo off screen and whatever back then in the world of Walking Dead, so it's fine, it's not a big deal, but the fact that Negan is not wearing a wedding ring is interesting to me and a bunch of people because what happened to his marriage? Did Annie die? Did he get robbed? Did he lose it? Did he not get another wedding ring? I'm, cur I'm sure you could, in your travels... Just go break into a jewelry store and get a wedding ring that fits. And in this great photo behind the scenes by Adam C. Cohen Photography, you clearly see the tattoos on JDM's knuckles, and I believe they're his kids, or at least Gus. Gussie Dean is his uh, son's name, Gus Dean. So I just think they're his real tattoos, and he has them here in real life, and he doesn't have them here on the show. But the fact that he has a wedding ring and was married, and Annie was his wife, and they were going to have a child... And we don't know what happened with Annie and the baby. It was never explained. We didn't see Annie again after uh, season 11, episode 22 or 23. I can't remember when the last time we saw her on the episode. We didn't see her in the finale, that's for sure. And the fact that we're asking the question, did Annie survive? Will she survive? There was some possible foreshadowing that she could have had trouble with the pregnancy at the Commonwealth, for sure. I mean, I don't know why Negan and uh, Annie didn't stay there to have the baby. Or maybe she did. We didn't know. Angela Kang said there was a scene with Annie that we never got to see because of time constraints and they cut it out of the episode. But one year later, we did see that. And Negan was somewhat involved with it when he sent a package to Judith with the compass. That was delivered by Lydia and Elijah. Well, we didn't see Negan and it was just something, you know, a nice callback to the compass with Negan and Judith. And we were always asked the question, what happened to Annie and Negan since the finale? Because we just don't know. I would think it to be explained right away in the Dead City pilot episode, the first episode that should air April 2023. That's the word right now. We don't know an exact date. But what are your thoughts about Annie and Negan? We don't see Annie in any of the promo photos, any of the stuff, the trailer breakdown for it, the quick teaser trailer. But I would think that Annie dies or kidnapped is the big thing because why is Negan alone in New York City and is there a connection? with Rick, Michonne, CRM, something there too. But the fact that he's not wearing a wedding ring is interesting because I know for a fact that people wear a wedding ring when their spouse dies. They refuse to take it off. You know, it's just a thing that reminds them that they are married still. The person's gone, but they still are committed to that person and it's a way to remember them and all that stuff. But the fact that he's not wearing one is interesting to me. 
Let me your thoughts, post your comments below, like, share, subscribe, support the PT channel any way that you can, donate, become a patron, a member, a subscriber, whatever you can do, we truly appreciate all the love and support. Either way, guys, stay safe, and as always, tell them, Daryl. Yeah, we love you guys.